be so amused when you tell them what happened to your face this weekend. Uh, yeah. They'll be amused, all right. Have a good day, son. Oh, but leave the porterhouse. I'm barbecuing tonight. Uh, hey, guys. How's it going? Oh, you know, pretty good, Teach. It's just... <gasps> Yeah, man, how'd you get that thing? What thing? I don't know what you're talking about. That shiner! I haven't seen so many colors in one face since Crackers the Clown jerked his chips in our classroom. I must confess, your black eye is an impressive example of ruptured blood vessels in the ocular region. If you guys don't mind, I'd rather not talk about it. Oh, look at that thing. Man, leave it to Tish to get into a class A scuff. Yeah, makes you wish you'd been there, darn. You don't really think TJ got in a fight, do you? Although TJ didn't confess to any misdoings, all evidence clearly suggests a physical altercation. Maybe he finally gave that big mouth loss to what's been coming to him. Or perhaps he was defending one of the little people. A downtrodden soul who needed his help. Well, whatever it was he did, I bet TJ risked his life doing it. Wow, what a guy! He's a hero and he doesn't even want anyone to know! So, Ted Weiler doesn't want anyone to know, eh? Well, I'll just see what I can do about that. President of the United States was revered the world over for his fortitude, his honesty, and his. Is it true? Is what true? Saving a whole nursery school from a pack of unchained pit bulls? You rock! What are you guys talking about? TJ, do you have something you'd like to share with the class? Uh, no, ma'am. Actually, I. <gasps> Good goddess! What happened to your eye, TJ? Well, uh. uh... Right on, TJ! Fight the power! Oh, boy. Gee, TJ, you're a real hero. Will you guys quit it with the hero stuff? I told you, it's not like that. After you. We made this special pie for you. But I can't afford a pizza that big. Oh, forget about it. It's her way of saying thanks for busting that bakery hold-up ring and saving them jelly donuts. But, but, thanks! And my dad said there was no such thing as a free lunch. Hey, it's pretty cool having a hero for a friend. Okay. Listen, guys, there's something I should let you... Yeah, Weiler! Mm -hmm. Oh, no, it's Gelman! I knew this day was too good to be true. I just knew it! Don't worry, Gus. TJ's got it under control. Don't you, Teej? Oh, man. Here goes the other eye. I've been looking for you, Detweiler. Okay, okay. Just let me have him. Let's get this over with. Oh, who ruined the surprise? Cookies! Triple chocolate chip. My granny stayed up all night baking them for me. But better you should have them, hero. But I'm no... Heroes don't wait in line? Heroes don't pay? Heroes get cookies? Okay, I give up. You want a hero? I'll be your hero. <laughs> I understand we have a hero in our midst. A kid who saved an entire platoon from a secret squadron of tofu-crazed vegetarians. You know how we treat heroes in my gym class, Detweiler? Exceedingly well. Absolutely. You, Detweiler, will enjoy a four-man no-kill zone while the rest of the cowards play bombardment. Oh, oh right, my favorite. Tender. Shark-infested waters? Not saying I did. Not saying I did. Oh, it's good to be the hero. Girls, this is what tasty glass of lemonade. Thank you. It's imported, and we totally have another surprise. Like follow up our secret candy spa. Woohoo! I have seen Evan, and it has a chocolate center. Oh man, this line will take forever. Leave this to L here. <clears throat> Day's work. Halt! You there, come forward. Hey there, Bob. Silence. <laughs> On your knees. Look, King Bob, this is all a big mistake. Hand me my royal staff. Something tells me our hero's journey just came to an end. But, but I can explain. Explain? After you quelled that kindergarten uprising? What's to explain? Huh? In the name of all royalty everywhere, I knight you, Sir TJ the Brave. <sighs> the decree that tomorrow shall be known as Detweiler Day! And what a day it will be! You sure seem to have had a change of heart about that black eye, champ. Yeah, today you seem almost proud of it. Well, I guess it just took a while for me to accept myself for who I am. Bye, Mom! Bye, Dad!
day. A day honoring this hero kid next to me. Let us begin by showering him with our thanks in the form of stuff. Well, what are you waiting for? Bring on the gifts. Announcing Sam and Dave, the diggers. We would like to present to you the coolest thing we ever dug up. A bicentennial quarter. Whoa, that's from the 70s. Announcing the hustler kid. Check it out. A genuine Swiss crafted beanie McChim pocket watch. Made in China. Cool. Announcing the guru kid. Oh, mighty hero, it is only befitting that a man-child as enlightened as you have the crown of rags, symbolizing your great inner strength and courage. Uh, thanks. Oh, where are we? Corn chip, girl. Don't tell me. You're giving me corn chips. Not all of them, sir. Just my most cherished chip. See? It's in the shape of Abraham Lincoln. <sighs> Gee, thanks. I'll make sure to put it in a special place. Like in my mouth. And now, Sir TJ, you shall regale us with your story. My story? Yes, the story of how you became a hero. Tell us all, from start to finish, and don't leave out any details. Well, okay, sure. Um, it all started with a call from the Pentagon. Yeah, that's it, the Pentagon, and... Theodore! Huh? What? Who said that? Down here, in your hand. Honest, Abe? Don't you think this lie has gone on long enough? But, Abe, they're throwing me a day here. I didn't get my own day by telling lies. But I didn't lie. Not yet, anyway. Who's he talking to? I have no idea. Look, TJ, my boy, sometimes letting people think something is true is just as bad as lying in the first place. Oh, sure, you didn't mean to let this story get out of hand, but if you don't put things straight, you'll have to live with it for the rest of your life. Tell the truth, son. It's the only way. <sighs> yeah, I guess you're right. Corn chip girl, I cannot accept this corn chip. <gasps> in fact, I can't accept any of these gifts, because the thing is, I'm not a hero. I guess you could even say, I'm a coward. A lot of stories have been going around about how I got this black guy. But I haven't had the guts to tell anyone the truth of how I really got it. See, there's this youth group my mom signed me up for. And last weekend they had... The Big Hoedown. Lucky us, we all got to learn to square dance. <laughs> Come on now, grab your partner and my team. Well, swing your partner and the man. Don't say no, hey, don't you bam. I'm a red man, man, I pick up your big bone and go right. Now switch your partner down and I... Who's that cowboy? Let's go find. Being a hero, not saving the world, but square dancing. He's <laughs> a <laughs> 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 square dancing? That's a good one. <laughs> Honestly, I did. 